Hello guys, welcome back to our channel. In this video, we will discuss the Lewis structure of NCO minus ion. It's a chemical formula of cyanate ion. Now, sometimes it is possible that there can be more than one Lewis structure of the same compound. These different Lewis formulas are called resonance structures. Also, it is important to note here that resonance structures are different from each other only in the arrangement of electrons, but the atoms keep same connectivity and arrangement. So let us see how to how we will draw the Lewis structure of the same. For that, we will first count the total number of valence electrons. So we have one carbon atom having four valence electrons, one nitrogen atom having five valence electrons, one oxygen atom having six valence electrons, and this negative charge here represents gain of an additional electron that gives us a total of 16 valence electrons. For the arrangement of atoms, we will place carbon atom in the center as it is the least electronegative element among the three. And then we will place electron pair between each atom for bond formation. Now nitrogen and oxygen need 6 more electrons for complete octet and carbon needs 4. Let us assign 3 electron pair to oxygen and 2 electron pair between nitrogen and carbon. We are still left with 2 more electrons that we will assign to nitrogen atom. Other way of arranging electron is by assigning nitrogen 3 electron pairs and oxygen 1 electron pair. We still have two more electrons and carbon and oxygen needs two more for complete octet so we'll arrange the remaining two in between them. For the next resonance structure we'll put two electron pair in between the atoms to assign and assign two electron pair to each nitrogen and oxygen atom. Now NCO- is an ion so we'll enclose it within a bracket. Let us calculate the formal charge of each atom in every structure. For nitrogen, we have 5 valence electrons minus 2 non-bonding electrons minus 6 bonding electrons divided by 2. That will give us a formal charge of 0. For carbon, we have 4 valence electrons minus 0 non-bonding electrons minus 8 bonding electrons divided by 2. That will give us a formal charge of 0. For oxygen, we have 6 valence electrons minus 6 non-bonding electrons minus 2 bonding electrons divided by 2. That will give us a formal charge of minus 1. Similarly, when we calculate the formal charge, we get the value of minus 2 on this nitrogen, 0 on carbon and plus 1 on this oxygen in this particular structure. For this structure, we get the value of minus 1 on nitrogen, 0 on carbon and oxygen. Now these two structures are the most ideal Lewis structures because of the minimal formal charge. And among these two, this one here is the most stable structure because here, Negative charge is on more electronegative element that is oxygen rather than on nitrogen. For more such videos, make sure to subscribe our channel and thank you for watching.